Every winter, all around the world, people voluntarily peel off their warm clothing and strip down to nearly nothing, all for the rush of jumping into freezing water. For some, it's a crazy tradition. For others, it's in the name of charity. But regardless of the reason, they're all participating in what's referred to as a polar bear plunge. It's a shock because you are jumping into cold water. My daughter says it's pins and needles, but I mean, it's like a whoo! I'm not fully mentally prepared yet, but we'll see how it goes. We'll have some fun and get cold. I don't know, I'm really scared. It's going to be so cold. <laughs> I'm really nervous because I know it's going to be really cold. Luckily, Cheryl had some reassuring words for us rookies. You're in, you're out, you're in the warming tent. At least the wind's not blowing too bad this year. Last year the wind was really blowing and that made it a lot worse. Comforting words, but unfortunately they're just that. Words. They don't make up for the frigid water we're all exposing ourselves to. What? We're not <laughs> Time to take the plunge. <laughs> shrieks come smiles because you know you just did something that a lot of people would never even consider doing. Plus, most plunges are for a cause. In this case, Special Olympics Montana. It was fun and it was for a great cause. It's a great way to raise money for our athletes. Oh, you're beautiful. Well, I can honestly say that today was the coldest I have ever felt and it literally took my breath away. But now I understand what polar plunging is all about and this was truly a thrilling winter adventure. In Billings with photographer Justin Hosa, I'm Angela Douglas from Montana's News Station.